if you have a cosmetics bag that's kind of full of like makeup dust from putting dirty brushes into it this will kind of help to prevent that so they won't all get tangled up and mixed up with each other i think this is so smart i think this section is maybe my favorite part of this whole bag with me on my wavy hair journey <laughs> um i'm using a lot more products than i usually do for my hair Welcome if you're new or welcome back if you're returning. Today I'm very excited to share with you the new uh, jewelry organizer and toiletry organizer from Mayton. So first of all, very special thank you to Mayton for providing both of these to me to review. If you haven't seen it, earlier this year I reviewed a set of handbags from Mayton. Uh, they're actually the number one seller on Amazon for, I think, travel backpacks, and they have a number of other different types of products. So I was really excited when they wanted to collaborate with me again on these travel items, and it was perfect timing because they arrived just in time for my very first vacation or overnight trip anywhere since November of 2019. However, the trip was unfortunately canceled due to a little cat emergency. So here is my special little old man. He had a bit of a health emergency this week. We actually had to take him downtown to the emergency vet because his eye, well he's blind, and one of his eyes had extremely high pressure in it. So now he's on some medication, he's doing a lot better already. You can tell he's a lot more comfortable and happy. So, it's a shame we had to skip our vacation, but my little baby was worth it. So even though I didn't have the opportunity to actually use these for traveling, um, I still have them kind of stocked up with some items just to show you how they work. Um, they're both really, really nice quality, nice, um, soft, you know, leathery material. The zippers are really fantastic. The inside organizational compartments and things, I'll show you all of that. And they're all just like really nicely thought out and really, really useful. So I am very excited about these and I'm excited for whenever I might be able to travel with them in the future, but they're even great for organizing things at home, I think. So um, let's start with the jewelry case. So the jewelry case is 10 and a half by two and a half by about seven inches. Um, it's basically like the size of your phone, um, at least the size of my phone. And the really neat thing about this is that it kind of unfolds and you see there's a little hook here. So you could hang this whole thing up and have access to all of your stuff inside. Or of course, you know, you could just lay it flat on a counter or something and use it that way. So um, I filled it with just a few pieces to show you how the different little kind of sections work. So on the top flap section here, there's a number of little separated uh, clear compartments that are um, zip shut. So in this one, I put just as an example, um, some little dangly earrings that might be kind of harder to, um, you know, get onto some of these other storage areas, but they fit perfect in this little section here. In the next section down is one of the best necklace organizers I have ever seen. So there's actually two levels of snaps. So if you have a longer necklace, you can snap it up at the top, or if you have a shorter one, you could snap it down here. And then the hanging part of the necklace actually goes through two layers of little elastic bands. So they won't all get tangled up and mixed up with each other. I think this is so smart. Um, also the interior like lining of all these is this really nice soft material. It's almost like a chamois cloth kind of material it's very nice so you don't have to worry about anything getting scratched I think this section is maybe my favorite part of this whole bag so then the next segment is probably the one that like I personally would use the most often there is a little uh, like mesh zipper compartment in here and then there's a little ring bar which you can actually unsnap from either end and it's made of that same super soft material. You can slide your rings right onto it, and it's just a little padded bar. And then this section holds your earrings uh, that have posts that will go through these little tiny holes, and it unsnaps on one side, so it kind of opens like a book, and you can just uh, thread your, your earrings through the holes and then put the backs on them, and that will hold them securely on this little panel. 
And then finally, this last flap section, um, again, just has a couple more clear uh, pockets that have zippers on. So to demonstrate this one, I put in kind of like a bigger necklace that doesn't really hang in a straight line. So I put it in here and you could keep it separate by itself. It would be great for like bracelets or again, maybe like larger earrings that aren't gonna go in here, but will lay flat in here. So um, again, it's just like a, a plain little pocket section and then the whole thing folds up and zips shut with really nice zipper and it even has this little handle i love how compact and flat this is um, i wouldn't worry about anything you know getting smushed or breaking in here because those inner panels are kind of uh, like stiffened so i don't think you know the whole thing's not gonna bend in your suitcase um, and it won't take up a ton of space because it will just kind of compress down so I really really like this bag you could also use it for um, you know little electronics or other little small things you want to organize so I this one's great the little jewelry organizer is excellent and then moving on to the toiletry organizer um, again you know I love little organizational features and things and this one has such nice little features I'm just gonna make sure that I get the dimensions right so there's actually like this top section and then the bottom section top section is two inches tall the bottom section is five inches tall so it'll be seven overall and then it is about 11 and a quarter wide this way and about six inches deep this way and i think that the pink with the black and white stripe is such a cute pattern um, again really nice materials this one it's a little bit different material than the jewelry case so the like leathery part is a little more of um, kind of like a smoother leather, I guess, or maybe, I don't know, maybe I would say it's more textured. It's a different texture than the other pink case. And then the black and white part is more of a fabric-y part, but the inside is all lined and everything for holding toiletries, so um, it, it works out really well. So in this top section, there is a little zippered mesh compartment just right inside the lid. And then um, I actually, I just sat these things in here just to show, um, you know, how it fits like full-sized products in here. So, you know, maybe I wouldn't take this on a plane, but definitely for traveling by car, this would be a great way to bring all your products. And with me on my wavy hair journey, <laughs> um, I'm using a lot more products than I usually do for my hair. So it's good to know that these kind of things fit. And then um, there's also a zippered uh, like clear plastic compartment in here. So again, everything is lined. It's all plasticky. It's all wipeable. So don't worry about anything spilling out in here because it all seems like it will be very easy to clean. Oh, I forgot. I also had a little hair product up here. This is uh, my Ex Mondo Viper Oil, which I've really been liking for um, letting my hair air dry and kind of keeping it a little more frizz free and it smells amazing. And then in the lower compartment, this part is actually really cool. It has some of my favorite kinds of organizational features for a toiletry case. So in the lid part, um, there is a little mirror. I didn't uh, remove the film, so I promise it's more <laughs> reflective than this. Um, there's also these little pockets that have like a little elastic band at the top so it will hold in whatever you have in the pocket. Right now, I just have like some things that are in tubes that kind of fit in here, but you could put brushes or other little small things that you don't want like falling out. And then I love this kind of brush storage thing. So actually, if you flip the mirror out of the way, um, there's some little skinny pockets for brushes or little pencils or different things. And then there's this flap with like a clear window in it. So that protects, I mean, it protects the brus brushes, it protects the bristles of the brushes, but also if they're dirty or there's anything that's going to come off of them, it protects the rest of your bag from that. So if you have a cosmetics bag that's kind of full of like makeup dust from putting dirty brushes into it, this will kind of help to prevent that. Um, and again, the whole inside, it's not the same type of material that's in the top half. It's more of just like a nylon-y material, but it is, you know, it feels like wipeable and washable. It doesn't feel like anything that's ruined <laughs> if, uh, if anything spills in it. And then the bottom half is, it's really just one big section, but it has these really cool um, removable dividers. So right now I have both dividers in here and it's divided it up into three separate sections. So I have like just different um, like makeup palettes and things in the bottom part. In the middle one I have lotions. And then in the top part I have some nail polish. Oh, this just happens to be Hollow Tacos Bring Me the Teal, which is also on my hands. I love this color. 
This is just my day of sharing internet purchases. Um, but you could also remove these sections and just Velcro in and out. And so you could either, you know, take it out, lay it flat in the bottom. They have little pockets on them as well for extra organization. Um, but then you see it just becomes like one big section in here. So it's really customizable to how you want to use it, what you need to fit in here. If you have, you know, some really large uh, containers that you want to put in, and maybe you take out all the dividers and you can just lay your large things right across here. And again, you know, you're not limited to using this with just cosmetics or toiletries. So you could organize maybe, I don't know, like cam again, electronic stuff, camera equipment with the little dividers. It might be a good way to keep like little lenses and things. Um, I'm kind of looking around my room to see like what else do I have in here that might be good to organize. I don't know, like more hair tools or um, yeah, electronics things, camera stuff, um, all your phone cables. Um, I don't know what kind of like Nintendos the kids are playing these days, but some of that stuff with all of its little accessories and games and things in here. So, you know, you can really get creative with these things. Like I said, I love organizational stuff and little pockets and sections and segments. So this is right up my alley and I'm sure you can find a million different things to use it for, but it's also really nice as a travel toiletry case. So thank you so much again for watching. Thank you to Mayton for sending me these. Uh, they will definitely be getting some use. I can't wait until I am actually able to go on a trip and use these in their intended purpose. But like I said, they're great for probably just organizing things around the house um, or organizing other types of things besides jewelry and toiletries. But they're really, really nice. So thank you again, and I will see you next time. Bye.